Positively Muskegon, it's Andy O'Reilly, and I am down at the chamber today to meet with Ed Garner. Ed is part of Muskegon Area First. Now, I've been in town for a while. I've heard the name. Tell me what Muskegon Area First does. Well, thanks, Andy, for having me on the program. Glad to be here, man. Great. Muskegon Area First is a countywide economic development agency, and most folks say, well, when, when is economic development? So, Right. Everybody's like, huh? Talk uh, about that, just a little bit. That, that could be just about any just about in anything that really is going to bring investment, going to be in job creation, going to help increase the tax base uh, for our community. So what we do on a day-to-day -day basis, we're working with companies primarily, trying to work for ways to help them grow and expand within the county. And also we're looking to attract new businesses here all the time as well, too, to help create those good paying jobs That's for what our folks in Muskegon. Yeah, so, we really do. Yeah. Talk a little bit about the business environment now. You must have a, uh, your finger on the pulse a little bit. Is, is, it, is it improving? Absolutely. You know, okay. um, since we got through the Great Recession, you know, those that were left standing are really... Barely. Are, 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 <laughs> Some of them barely. Well, they're busy. They're busier than ever, a lot of the yeah. companies. We, we work, on, work a lot in the manufacturing space, okay. a lot of industrial companies. And so we kind of gauge the economy a little bit by how they're doing. And so now, before they were fighting for orders, now they got back orders. You know, you, you can't get a product made from them in five, six months or so. so really? So that, that's a good that's a good sign. That's a really uh, good sign. A lot of us in Michigan is driven, we know, by automobiles. So sure. the automo automobile industry is kind of going pretty strong. And then for us in Muskegon, the aerospace industry, a lot of folks don't know that the aerospace industry is big here in Muskegon. Matter of fact, you can't fly on a domestic plane without having a part made from Muskegon. I know. Right I've here. had them on. We've okay. talked to right. well, them. Okay. GE Aviation's well, been on here. Well, we, GE we Aviation and Alcoa Howmet. Alcoa Howmet. How you you can't fly on a plane today without having no, a part from uh, Muskegon in here. And it's in the critical part of the engine that keeps the, the yeah, plane keeps up. Keeps you in the air. So, so, <laughs> so every time you fly, say, thanks, Muskegon. <laughs> you, you, you're keeping us alive here. So That's what they're doing, <laughs> too. So things are looking better. Everybody's you know doing a little bit better, right. and we're starting to make that turn. You know, part of this blog is to is to point out the things that are going on that can a help people mm -hmm. and b kind of show you that Muskegon isn't really getting our just due. You correct, know, there correct. there's a lot of great things going right. on here by a lot of great people, and it's time to start telling that story. Absolutely, that's what we're doing. Absolutely, you guys are putting together this business resource team. Tell me about the BRT. That's a quote quote. <laughs> BRT. Tell me about this. This is a great. This is like only one in the state. Well, only one we know of that's formerly like this, okay. at least within West Michigan. So we're, we're hoping that it's going to catch on, and you'll sure. start seeing these BRTs in other parts of the, the region and the state. But the Muskegon Business Resource Team was kind of a concept. Uh, myself and some of the other resource partners were sitting around the table and saying, hey, it's got to be a better way for us to, to reach out to our to our customers be, out there. In Muskegon, there are a lot of agencies that all kind of do the same thing. Yeah. Well, we don't, well, I, well, I mean, we don't, to a degree. Yeah, but yeah. we don't necessarily do the same thing. But it's but it's, it's several of us that are out there visiting companies, trying to tell companies to explain what we do, and it's time consuming for us going out. Yeah, one week I'm there, somebody else there the next week, and it's taking up the business owner's time. Our, our goal is the end goal is really to help move the bar and help them sure. grow and expand. So sure. so we're all working on the same mission, but it's like uh, you know attacking a tiger is more than one way to skin a cat, as they say. Right, you know, right. and so we're all at our. I'm tacking the legs. Somebody's tacking the you know the elbow or something. You know, type, <laughs> type, type deal. So, but the, the but the BRT is about right now. It's about 18 of these resource partners. Okay. So it's agencies like the the Muskegon Community College and the Chamber of Commerce and our Career Tech Center. Yeah. You know, uh, as folks like the Employers Association. Uh, just a, a group of a host of everybody. So we're up to 18 right now. Wow. So uh, of these resource partners, and they may be more in the in the future. But what we're trying to do is collectively really come out and approach businesses to to tell them what we do, kind of all in one one space, and instead of coming out individually, individually talking to them, talking to them. Once again, the goal is to help help get them resources they may need today, or they may not even thought about. You know. That's the thing, you know, yeah, when you go yeah. into business for yourself, you don't always think of every little thing you're going to need yeah. as it grows and as it expands. A absolutely. That's where you come in. That's where we come in. So what we do, we come out and we do a lot of listening, you know, before we do a lot of talking. We try to find out where you're at, where you want to go, 
you may be coming up for, for us for a specific need. But then we start thinking, uh, the light bulb start going on, well, this guy may need some training dollars yep. or or he may need some uh, some counseling. His business plan may, may need to be tightened up a little bit. He may be looking for some finance and, you know, right, to, right. to make it happen. So we got connections to all of that. Perfect. See, but, but people don't know that. They That's don't, the problem. They, they don't know what they don't know. So <laughs> what happens is, you know, they miss out. So you, the, you really miss out on some things because you really don't didn't know these things exist. I'll tell you what happens. Some guy gets a GoPro and he goes around and finds guys like you to talk about what's going on around here. Absolutely. That's what happens. Okay, okay right. <laughs> so keep watching, everybody, because right. we, we want you to know what's going on throughout. June seventh, you're going to have a consolidated get together. Absolutely. Let's talk about Absolutely. this. Absolutely. That's called a Resource Connect event. Okay. Now we're going to do this at the new Verdoni's Event Center. Right up there on Seminole Road. Right on Seminole Road. If you ever dined there and, and ate there, they're converting that to an event center. Okay. I think ours will be the second event that, they, really? that they're having there. I cool. think they got a, a wedding party or something there the weekend before. Ours is on a Tuesday. So we're excited about that. We're excited about you know that new facility. Sure. They're excited to have us. Sure. And uh, so we're going to be out there in the morning. It's you know, the event we're running. Pretty much eight to nine thirty, so it's a it's kind of a breakfast event. So sure. so you got to get up, you know, yeah, well. to you know. But we'll give you coffee and a, and, right. and a little something <laughs> to keep you going. But uh, we want to we want to attract as many people to come out to this. It's free, no free. cost at all. Free event to come out. We're all going to be there. The state of Michigan is going to have folks out from their economic development team as well. They're helping underwrite the event as well. And not often do we get money from the state to right. do right. things like this. So we're very excited about having them as a partner and stuff as well. And then you'll get a chance to hear from all the partners. And then more importantly, you'll get a chance to network with them one-on-one. -on -one. Talk, talk to yeah, them. Yeah, get up close like we are now and, and try and say, hey, this is maybe, how can you help me out with, with this or the other? Yeah. And we'll see how it goes. So we, we want to help as many folks as possible. It's, you know, so me being one person, it's impossible for me to get out and see everybody out there. Oh, so, I know that so, I'm, so I'm hoping uh, the folks will come to me, yep. you know, I'll stand by the side of the road and, and, <laughs> and, they'll just, and you know, they'll stop and see me versus me trying to t chase everybody down. So, so, so we think it makes sense. Yeah. We think it makes sense, but I'll, we'll be honest, this is our first attempt at yeah, it. It's going to be a great event. We'll see how it goes. We're hoping to be a great success on that. And we want to do more of these in the, in the future. Good. So. So you'll come in contact with all the business resource team members, or even after that, if you just want to call up and ask for a business resource team visit, yeah. you'll be able to do that at, the, at our main number here with the chamber, which is 722-3751. Uh, okay. Once again, 722-3751. <laughs> so uh, just call that number. Say I heard about this business resource team thing. Uh, you'll get the, you'll get a, um, you'll get a live person okay. <laughs> that, that, that'll help you walk through the process. We'll get some team members out there to help you with your needs. Awesome. And, and so do it that way. And, and and certainly we the goal is if we can help everybody out there that needs help, that that'd be great in one form or fashion. It's Muskegon. If you need a hand, it's there. All you got to do is reach out and ask. It's June seventh at Verdoni's Event Center. All the details will be right here on Positively Muskegon. You'll find all the links, everything else. Ed Garner, thanks for taking a couple of minutes this morning. Thanks, Andy. We Good appreciate you, it. Man. Okay. Positively Muskegon, make sure you're at that business resource team meeting. BRT. That's the new word in town right there. BRT. We'll get you underway in Muskegon right here. Thanks again, Ed. Thank you.